Hello everybody, my name is AR and welcome to Franbo. So those of you who do follow the uh, gaming news and stuff, you guys should know that this is a pretty old game. Two years, I think. Um, and I played the demo of this like a super long time ago. I don't remember the demo that much. Um, but we finally got into this, so here we go. I just started up to make sure the game worked. Didn't actually go into any of the storyline. Here we go. Everything's fine. It feels like heaven. That doesn't look like heaven. I see my parents. They look happy. They have a present for me. I wonder. It's a cat. So sweet and pretty. Dark as the deepest night. It's Mr. Midnight, my best friend, my only friend. We are having dinner and I see Aunt Grace too. I really like her a lot. It's Friday, my parents are going out. Aunt Grace takes good care of me. We are having so much fun. It's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. But something feels real bad. Hi. A strange creature outside my window. I don't like it. It scares me. Suddenly I hear something. It's mom screaming. I want to know what's wrong. A bright light shines from my parents' room. I go closer. And closer. Mom? Dad? Please don't. Mommy? Daddy? Ah, the Hooded Alliance, as it usually is. Fran, please, follow my voice. On the count of three, you will wake up. One. Two. Hey, we're back. Three. Fran, how do you feel? I feel like dying. I don't understand why you make me do this. Try to calm down. This is part of your recovery. Recovery? Don't you get it? My parents are dead. Oh, poor thing. Everything will get better. I promise. Better? Then let me go. That would be better. You should not tell me how to do my job. But now I have something for you, Fran. Oh, really? See the desk? There's a little package for you. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. Oh, am I controlling now? Here we go. This was my mother's purse. Open it. There's something inside. Uh, use. No? Examine? Dearest Fran, here's the purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remembered that you like to examine objects and combine them with other things. 
So I hope you'll always keep this purse and give it and all the other things you find a good use. Never forget that creativity is absolutely the greatest gift you have. Love, Aunt Grace. She's worried about you. I'm worried too because I'm not crazy and still here. Stop it. You are out of control, young lady. I'm so tired of all of this. I just want to go to my room. Yes, you can leave. But before you do, it's time for your new medicine. What medicine? It's called Duo Tea and it will make you feel very relaxed. Nurse, we're ready. Oh, hi. Anything new today, Dr. Dear? Nothing, actually. Same visions as before. Oh, I see. Here, Fran, take your medicine. What, what if I don't wanna, huh? What if I don't do anything? You, you can't for We don't have all day then. Okay, fine. Fine, I'll take it. Oh, wait, this was from the demo. I don't feel good. Yeah, this was from the demo. Oh no, take her back to her room. And nurse, don't let her take this ever again. So I guess they're trying to treat her in some way, but the pulls have side effects all the time. Whoa. Beware, Franbo. If you leave the House of Madness, I will hunt you down, catch you, and bring you back to insanity. Wait, is that Liam Neeson? He's gonna hunt me down? Fran, wake up! The medicine will help you escape. Are you sure about that? I'll be waiting for you in the forest. I love you. Are you sure, Mr. Midnight? Because it seems like it has pretty bad side effects. Also, if you didn't notice, I changed my camera angle, so it's a bit different now. Hope you appreciate that. It's kind of darkish, though. Wait, hang on. I'm no. Is is that better? I don't know. What do you guys think? Is that better? I don't really think so. I'm going to switch it off for now, though, but... What's up, Fran? I'm still here, hideous place. I have to get out of here. Yes, you do. Okay, so I'm in control now. What's a clown doing in an asylum? I will get your nose. I will get it. I didn't expect that to pop up when I clicked on it. Okay, what's this? The patient was found near the Oswald Asylum showing ten signs of uh, psychosis. The Bo Dagenhardt family tragedy details omitted. She's only 10 and she has all of this already, seriously. That is that is actually kind of sad though. Red and Tiny, you are hiding from me, so uh, that's the pulls. I hate the monster, I have to find Mr. Midnight, I have to find him now. I miss my kitty, he hides because he's afraid. He told me that the medicine would show me where he is. Okay, my cat is like legit right here, sleeping, as per usual. So let's help you find your cat, shall we? Fran. Locked. Good reason to get curious. Hmm. Oh, holy moly. Something fell. A handy hook. I'll save it to play pirate later. Sure, because that's normal things that you would do in an asylum. Ooh. Tower defense we have you for a crazy person called Fran. Okay. So I guess that's my escape routine outside. What's this said? Oh, hello. Ooh, a box. Oh, oh, a secret box. Shh. What's your name? Hello, Phil? Dr. Phil? Hello. Shh. No, anyway, out my bird is screaming. Why? There are many ways out. Uh, yes, but you know that everything is locked, right? Indeed, but the office is the key. What do you mean? I saw the doctor write a secret code. A secret code? To open the yellow door? He doesn't want me to tell you. The doctor? Him. 
Whoa, hey, hi, how's it going? All doors are closed. You are a prisoner of my games. And nobody will help you escape. Okay. Leave me alone. I hate you. Mommy, Daddy, I need you so much right now. No, I won't let that monster stop me. Uh, okay, so I guess this is locked in. Yep, okay, what's the other side? Uh, boop. Oh, hi! How are you doing? You're not the one that gave me the pills, though. My legs are just fine. You have gray hair. Empty bottle, empty glasses, nothing useful. Oh, I want to know what she's writing, but I'm cu oh, I'm curious. Oh, Fran, you're awake. Good. How long was I asleep? Three days? Was it the medicine that made me sleepy? Yes, it was the medicine. That's why you're not taking it anymore. I did something. See, you are nothing but trouble. What is it? I uh, broke the curtains. Not my fault. Someone framed me. Okay, go fix this. Yes, leave the room while I take a look at your desk. Okay, bye. Let's look. Nope. I'm curious, yes, but the nurse is still inside this room. Oh, come on. Oh, you're still here. Hi. Something is missing. Have you seen the hook that holds the curtains up? What? What's a hook? <laughs> yes, because every 10 year old doesn't know what a hook is. Well, I have to go find something to fix this, you little girl. Okay, bye. Are you leaving the room now? Okay, she's gone. Let's do this. Ooh. Oh, I'll keep these patches to stop blood. Cool. Ew. Violent trauma can have a great impact on children, totally changing their normal lives. For example, children damaged by trauma can have mild to severe de deficits in some abilities, such as trusting people near them, seeing the world as a safe place, making decisions, etc. Because of these effects, some traumas can lead to several symptoms of major mental illness. For example, not trusting other people or not feeling safe in the world, this can be interpreted as paranoia. Okay. The patient has been s what the heck, this is the worst writing ever. Even Fran thinks it is. The patient has been sleeping almost all the time. She only wakes up to drink water. But I don't think she remembers that. After drinking, she she goes to sleep again. She hasn't been uh, social for three days now. Some kids have come around and asked about her and when she would come and play. Jeez, that is, why do doctors always have the worst handwritings? Like, seriously. Uh, okay, 8H. Okay, so that's letters of the alphabet. Maybe a code? Okay. Woo! I think this is where the medicine is, but it's locked. Holy moly! What nurse needs a gun? Seriously? Exactly, why would the nurse have that? She wants to kill us all. I'll leave it as it was. Yeah. So when I got this, she said the pearls are in there. Ah, you see? So they said H was eight, uh, A B C D E F G H I nine, A B C D four, A B C D five. There we go. Ah, the pills. Kitty told me these would help me, but I don't know if Kitty lying because Kitty's gone. Oh, hello, Mr. Shadow Man. Get out, creepy creature. Nurse, no, what happened? Hello, Miss Nurse. Are you alright? Does she look alright to you, Fran? Hello? Huh. This kind of looks like the nurse that gave me the pull. Because... Are you a what? No, my cat's still sleeping. Because she has darker hair. Ooh. Oh, so I can find things in the normal world and in the pull world also. That's cool. That's... Hi. How are you doing? Ha, ah, that's my head. Can I have it back, please? 
My head is just being held by a creepy three-headed creature with white mask and bloody eyes. Okay. This was locked, so... It's locked. Okay, hang on. Can I actually go out? Okay, I can go out of pull wall. Can I use this to pick it? Are you? Are you really that clever? I'm not. Unless this has something. Yes! Haha! -ha. Please tell me this goes for this. Yes! Ooh! Uh, exam. Oh, That's so sad. Wait, what happens? Because the whole world changed when I took a pull. What happens if I take a pull and look at the picture? Do I dare? Okay, that's pleasant. Okay, let's just go down the stairs that mysteriously appeared. No, absolutely not. You can't tell her that. But she has to know. You can't keep me away from her. The reason is more than clear, Grace. No, it's not. I want to take her home now. You can't. Fran's mental condition is not yet appropriate yet. Oh, so the doctor wants to keep me because he thinks that I'm not stable yet. Mentally stable. Was that real? Oh dear, Aunt Grace. I wonder what she has to tell me. That doctor has no soul. I'm going home tonight. Okay, what's this said? Hi! All the weird things in this room. Why is your mouth sewn together? Hey, Phil, you okay, buddy? Why are you looking at me like that? You terrify me. <laughs> to happiness and the door. Why is there a deer all of a sudden? Oh no, your head. <laughs> I'll try to put your head back on. Oh. Nope. Nope. Okay, I'm going out of this. That's just... That's too much. So can I pick you at least? Almost, but there's another hole. I need something. Oh. Ah. Okay, okay, I'm getting it, I'm getting it. Uh, let's take a pull. Hi! How are you doing? So wait, I have a question though. Was the monster that came through the portal, uh, the one I saw at the beginning during the storyline? Or was it that thing that just popped up now? Because the picture looked like he had a top hat. During the storyline, it looked like he had a top hat. I don't know. We'll have to figure that out soon. Let's look out the window. Nope. Boarded up. Okay. Hi. You're my beloved friend. Beep, beep. Brrr. If you want to hug me, try and catch me. Brrr. Was Is that thing talking or is... I don't know. Um. This is coming here then. Hi! A normal person? Amazing! Hello! You see them. You do, right? What? See what? The creatures that follow everyone. The shadows? Uh-huh. I can't see them, but I know they're there. Do you know what they are? Yeah, I guess. Tell me, please. You like to draw? I love to draw! I love it too, but you can't just change a topic like that. Crayon! I want a crayon! I want to find a crayon! I draw all the time. I want to find my cat. Even though he's right there. Draw a cat if you don't have one. I could draw my cat, but I'd rather find him. Your cat is in danger. The shadows took him. I know. Who told you that? Who did tell you that? The one that follows me. Buy. I can click on the crayon. I can't click on anything else there. But let's look at this first. This bed is very pink. Is that all? Okay, let's just take a crayon. That's mine. My crayons. Can I have it? No, I won't be able to draw green then. That's ridiculous. But you have so many. Yes, many colors. But you know, they don't like me drawing. Who? The nurses, they tie me up and when I want to draw, I can't. The nurses are crazy. When I can't draw, I hurt myself. Then comes the red milk? Oh, why couldn't you just call it blood? 
Please cure me, yes? And stop the red milk. I'll see what I can do. Um, what about this? The patient was a victim of sexual abuse by an unknown person which almost killed her. This event has created auditory hallucinations and thought disorder. That's actually quite sad though. So maybe there's something in this room that I can use to stop the red milk. Oh, that's the shadow that follows you, hey? Why did you turn into a doll? Yeah, why do you look like a fabric doll? And why is this chair rocking? I mean, I love ghost things, but that's just not right. Um... I don't know what to give you. Oh, I have the first aid things I can use on you. I just took a whole journey back to my other room to look for something. Oh, thank you. You can have the crayon. Now go. I have to draw. Thanks. Got me a crayon. A crayon. That's cool. Whoa, whoa. Uh, what's this though? What are you? Is that my bird? Oh no, that's a kettle. The king likes drawings. <laughs> Hi! Hi! Who was that? I'm just gonna, uh, you know, I don't need to use it right now. I'm a, I'm a bounce, alright? Oh, hi. Huh, there you are. You should be in your room. The door was closed. No, but you left it open. I'm sure it was not open. I know, because I locked it. How did I get out then? It was open. Hmm, don't try to trick me. Go inside your room and wait for the doctor. Okay, I guess I'll comply with that. Ugh, I have no time for this. I have to find my way out. Oh, hi, Dr. Four Eyes. Do you break out of your room? That's not nice, friend. But I ha I'm hungry, sir. I haven't eaten in days. I won't listen to any of your excuses, young lady. Let me go eat something. Sir Doctor, please just let me go out and eat something. You have to learn how to listen to those in charge. Of course, sir. Lesson learned. Just don't do it again, friend. Go and eat now, then get back to bed. Okay. Well, it's been 20 odd minutes. I'm gonna leave this episode over here of Franbo. Um, I'm gonna not, I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna put an intro video in this just because I want it to be all game. So, um, geez, this is actually hurting. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna leave this episode over here for Franbo. I think I'll just continue playing. But this episode has been long, it takes a while to edit it. So I'm going to leave it over here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, let me know down in the comments below and give this video a like. I'm going to whole play through this game. I like it. The demo was really good. This game seems to be good on its own already. So thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, until next time, game on. out of Yana? Miracle, yes!